A unique web-based water system is making a big difference in water conservation efforts at Eglin Air Force Base in Florida. The web-based water system provides us with so much functionality. To put it into a short summary, it, it uh, pulls all of our uh, assets together into one place, all of our permits, uh, our mapping functionality. Uh, we can analyze data uh, back to 12 years previous. The system connects everyone from the water utility shop all the way to the base civil engineer and allows everyone access to analyze the base's water data. We can actually monitor our, our actual usage versus uh, where we can look at it daily, uh, real time. I mean, every day we can bring it up and see where we're, where we're losing uh, water. Using the system, operators can perform trending analysis to see if there is a water leak in a certain area. Eglin recently completed a major leak detection repair project. The base leak checked around 120 miles of water mains on the base. The leak detectors identified several areas that were leaking, leaking hydrants, leaking valves, on top of what the water utility shop had found uh, over the years previous and then big leaks. So we, instead of putting band-aid fixes on it, we replaced large uh, lengths of pipe from hydrant to hydrant, valve to valve, uh, to give us that upgraded infrastructure uh, benefit and actually to, to actually stop the leaks uh, from occurring. That leak detection project is expected to save the base up to 15 million gallons of water a year. It also provided other benefits. From that project we've gained about approximately five miles of brand new uh, infrastructure. We replaced it. We looped in dead-end areas that improved water quality considerably. There are other projects in the works at Eglin to find even more water conservation savings. Many of the irrigation systems on base currently use the potable water system, which actually puts a strain on the natural resource of the Florida aquifer system. We've actually gotten funding for a project to actually take all of these systems off of the potable water irrigation system and to install these shallow uh, well irrigation systems. Uh, if needed. If the site does not need irrigation just like we did at the 7th Special Forces, if it's not uh, an imminent need, we're going to actually remove the irrigation altogether and not put in the irrigation wells. The irrigation project is expected to save another 20 million gallons of water per year and will help protect the Florida aquifer system as well.